Hey guys, just saw with a video for you guys. So this one I'm actually have to do for my own benefit because there's a possible chance that one of these boxes is resealed from Amazon Prime Day, which is fun. I have never been blessed by Amazon before with the reseal, but it is a possibility that it happened. So I'm just gonna go over, I guess, what to look for. But this one's kind of pretty obvious, and I could be 100% wrong, but the differences are glaring. Uh, so. The one that these two, you can see, the, I got both of these from Amazon. I actually got a few more. Now, I'm going to say this is the regular looking one. I have more of these. They all look the same. They all have the Wizards of the Coast sticker, which is something that's usually on everything. And I was skeptical only because I did go to a pre-release for Guilds of Ravnica. What was it? Guilds for Ravnica? Yeah, so many Ravnicas. What are the Guilds over Ravnica? I can't even remember. The, the yellow one. We'll just say the yellow Ravnica box. That's not Dragon's Maze. We'll just say that. But for some reason, the guy opened my, the LGS opened a fresh case and the boxes had no, um, what do you call it, sticker on it, even though they started doing the stickers. So I don't know if it was a fluke, so that's why I can't say 100% that they maybe forgot to do the sticker. Also, I think it rubs off sometimes, depending on like if it hits stuff. So as you can see, a collector booster box, what it should look like, it should have the the Wizard of the Coast logo somewhere. So usually it's printed sometimes randomly. This one is pretty much all over the box. And then you have it on the bottom too. So you can see the bottom. All right, so my lighting quality is pretty bad. But as you can see, there's a big difference between this and then we go to the other one. And this. <laughs> this one has no Wizards logo. This looks like shrink wrap that could possibly be put on anything. And the tag that usually is folded under the box is showing. So it's kind of hard to see. I don't have the best quality camera, but the tag that, you know, like flips under is showing. So not, not a good sign. So that's usually a big sus. Usually the biggest suspect of the reseal is the plastic itself, like whether it's torn open. So as you can see, this one has a, actually you can't really see that on my camera, but it's a very, very thin straight line. It's very, very tight. You know, I can barely move it. Well, on this one, you can see this bubble, it sticks out, and I can, like, you know, I can pull it <laughs> and flap it up, or whatever you want to pull it. So, yeah, I'm not having good hopes for this, and I never return things to Amazon. And I heard you weren't supposed to be able to return things, uh, cards to Amazon, but we'll have to see what Amazon support says if this is messed up. So, let's now go into opening. So, that's pretty much the only flaws I see here. And what people do is they take these, they open them up. They refill the cards with like G.I. Joe or something stupid or just bulk magic cards and they reseal the packs. So I might have to actually send this video to Amazon. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna keep this one in the video here just so we can show the difference. And I'm going to pray, but I'm not optimistic that this is uh what do you call it, a legit product. And it would suck if I get a refund because this was cheap, very cheap on Prime Day. And I would love to, you know get my products but it's sold out so there's a good chance yeah this looks like some any old plastic but i'm not a plastic expert expert so yeah the flap let's see so yeah the flap is definitely moved but let's go open here and let's see what we got so there should be let's count the boosters first let's say it's just pulling out so we got our boosters so it should be 12 uh, wait, it doesn't even tell you how many, I don't know if they'll be able to work, but it doesn't tell you how many boosters are in there. Okay, so let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Alright, so, these look fine, but we gotta open them to see what's what. So, with boosters, you wanna make sure there's no holes or, like, glue shifting around. That doesn't seem to be the case, but I don't know. I am seeing a little, uh, I don't know what these marks are, you can't really see them, but there's, like, little claw marks, that little swipes up and down the thing. So let's open it up. So I'm going to tear this open carefully. So, alright, that opened it pretty easily. And the token's there, that's for sure. Alright, so let's see what we get. So I'm just going to go through this really quickly. So Feywood, Death Freeze, The Forest. Oh, these are so cloudy. Oh my goodness, why are the foils so cloudy? That's pretty bad. Uh, Vengeful Ancestor. And the Venka, Direwolf Prowler, No Hunter, and Lolith Spider Queen. So, wait, even more foils? Dijin Winder? I've never opened this before, collected so I don't know. Uh, white, 
Uh, that's a rare, you can barely tell because of the... Whatever, and we got a spider. Alright, that, that seems legit. <laughs> it is not that much value in this set, but... I don't know, so... Maybe, maybe I'm an idiot, and I just completely went crazy. Failed completely. So, Brazen Dwarf. But the foils are ugly. Oh, they're so clouded. It's not even funny. Camera's probably not even doing it justice. Oh, Wild Mage. She's or something, I think. Um, Min Willy Illusionist. Long Rest. Under Dark Basilisk. Something. Old Gnaw. But all right, so I am going to admit I am an idiot and I am totally wrong. <laughs> that's, that's the best. That's the that's the best card in the set, if I remember correctly. <laughs> and, oh, Werewolf Pack Leader. Oh, my hands are very shaky. Oof, I'll have to go over that and I'll be live because that's why I'm, I I downloaded DayZ, but I'm not playing any games at the moment. I'm just I was just uploading this and I, I'm just gonna upload it anyway because I am stupid. But yeah, all right. So it is legit. It seems. It was just weird that it. I got all the other ones I got looked like this that are perfectly intact, and then this one was like absolutely beat up. So maybe it just got damaged on the shelf or got ripped but then like yeah who knows or maybe somebody was like you know what i opened all the good cards i'm gonna return it reseal it and make somebody new day <laughs> so thanks for watching i apologize for being stupid and i hope to have a vlog i, I don't, I don't want to promise any time frame for a vlog but i'm hoping to have something soon other than me failing at open magic cards so see you guys next time